welcome to this DVD update. I thought I would do this now as I've got a lot of catching up to do with films so I probably won't be buying no films or TV for a couple of weeks so I thought I'd do this update now as the other one might be a month or so away. So first up is The Devil's Backbone. This is a film by Guillermo del Toro who did Hellboy 1 and 2, uh, Pan's Labyrinth and I've, so I watched Pan's Labyrinth recently and I really really like that so I thought I'd check this out. It's Devil's Backbone, I've not watched this yet, I plan on watching it quite soon. So that's the Devil's Backbone. The next one I picked up was The Science of Sleep by Michael Gondry who did Eternal Sunshine, Sunshine of the Spotless Mind which I really really enjoyed, it was an amazing film. Not watched this one either yet. I just know it's a it's a French film, but I've watched the trailer and it looks really interesting. So look forward to watching this. Now onto the Blu-rays. First up is Shea Part One and Two. This is Benicio del Toro. Um, it stars in this as Shea Guerrera, whatever his name is. I can't really say it. And then it's directed by Steven Soderbergh. This is the two disc set, so you've got the two films in there, you've got Shea Part 1 and then you've got Part 2, so that's both the films and I'm really looking forward to watching these, heard great things about it really really good, it's supposed to look on Blu-ray and yes that's Shea Part 1 and 2 bargain for £12 on HMV website, so if you're interested in these definitely check out the deals on that then I got Creep Show. This is the American edition, but it plays on any Blu ray player because it's region free. Like I said in a previous one, you can get these on movietime.com, which is a, a site where you can get region 1 DVDs and region 3 Blu rays and region A Blu rays and a lot of things they do. And you don't get charged import fees or customs, and it's great for if you like collecting Region 1 DVDs. And they do some great prices on there. This was £8, I think, or something like that, or £9. I know in Region 2 we've got a really nice set with a nice slipcase, but I wanted to pick this up on Blu ray, and for £8 you can't really go wrong. This is just a standard one disc edition. But for its age, it's supposed to look really, really good on Blu-ray, and the sound's supposed to be amazing. So I'll probably let you know how how this is when I've watched it. I've never actually watched this before, so quite interested in seeing that. Then we've got a film which is by Guillermo del Toro again. This is another Spanish horror. This is The Orphanage. Really, really excited to watch this as well. I watched the trailer and it looks absolutely amazing. All I know it is it's a one disc there. All I know it is about a woman who owns an orphanage and there's this kid that comes as you can see there with this and he always wears this like bag over his head and he's like the main part of the film. But from what I saw in the trailer it looks absolutely re amazing, really really good film. This was Seven pound on Play.com, I think, so you can't go wrong. Then we've got a film that I was really looking forward to this year by Tony Scott, which is the Taking of Pelham One Two Three. This is a remake of the 1974 classic. This let me down a tad, not too much, but I was really expecting something dead good. Don't get me wrong, it was really good. I really like Tony Scott and Ridley Scott's films, but this was a bit too much straightforward thriller for me actually. I really like films like The Departed that you get a major twist in the end in thriller films but yeah I know you can't get brilliant thriller films all the time with amazing twists as good as like The Departed but this was not too bad but a bit straightforward thriller. Really enjoyable. Drums Revolt is amazing in it so is Denzel Washington. It's also got James Gamfaldini from The Sopranos in it who plays the mayor of New York which is also good to see so yeah this is just a standard one disc edition but it's got a lot of special features on 
So if you're interested in this, I'd definitely pick it up, and it looks pretty damn good on Blu-ray. Next up, I've got two, which are probably the best bargains that I've ever picked up on Blu-ray to date. That is, first, it is Tom Cruise Mission Impossible Trilogy. This was £14, which is an absolute bargain on HMV website. It is all over the web for that price. And what you get in it, you get is Mission Impossible. Just a single disc. You get Mission Impossible 2, another single disc. And you get Mission Impossible 3, which is supposed to be one of the best action films ever made. Two disc edition. So like I said, this was £14 on HMV. And I had to look separately, and you'd be looking about £30 to £40 if you brought them all separately. So for a, a bargain box set for that price you can't go wrong, £14. The next one is another great bargain. This was £17. This is the Ultimate Born Collection on Blu-ray. Again, you get all three films, Born Identity, Born Supremacy and Born Automaton. I love the first one of this, I've got this on DVD, but I thought if I can get them all three again, I was planning to upgrade to Blu-ray on them anyway. So I thought if I can get all three again, why don't I for £17? An absolute bargain. I really enjoyed the first. Great action film. Probably going to re-watch that and then watch the other two. So yeah, another great bargain. Which does the Bourne Ultimate Collection. So like I said, that was all for this update guys. Thanks for watching and I'll do my best to do another one as soon as I can. Thanks.